Hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. My name is Robert Luigi. In the last episode, we set off in direction, in the direction of this area over here, Laneru Wetlands and Spring and that sort of thing, because we were trying to get to the Rito- Ritos? Oh, they're so close. Ruto is making me think it's Rito. The Zoras are here. I could- we're gonna go there at some point, because we now have this, which means our passageway to that is not that hard. However, I've become very distracted and we are now here for some random reason. All I want to do, actually, because we lost a lot of hearts trying to get an ice rod for some goddamn Korok last episode. The broom is a weapon. I've just noticed. That's good. What was I doing? Yes. I came here because I wanted to sleep off some of the 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 pain, effectively. What I also did is I cooked up some of my durians. Durians were on trees in that area where the Zoras aren't, like the bottom right. Durians, as you can see, are the king of fruits. What I've done? Holy fuck. I picked up a lot of durians. Do you want to see what I've done to the durians? You can see in the bottom, the top left rather, what would happen if we ate certain food. <laughs> Look at this shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look how amazing this shit is. This is two durians, maybe one durian. This is like all of the durians. Maybe it's four hearts per durian, so that'd be three, that'd be five. Durian's pretty good. I've also, I'm also here because Beetle here said he wants my beetle, I think, uh, or something. He wants to give me, uh, uh, he wants me to give him the energetic rhino beetle because he'll give me a hearty elixir. Heard about the elixirs. I'd like to learn about the elixirs and I kind of know whether we can get more beetles if we need to find them. So it's basically a potion for recovery and four hearts. So they're slightly more manufacturable food, but more, more sort of traditional Zelda food, effectively potions. It's very nice. He likes his beetles. Because he's called Beetle, I get the joke video game. I al I've always got the joke. So it's a, it's a consumable item. Technically it's food, but it's not food, which I guess is kind of interesting. I'm going to sleep and I'm going to go back to Laneru Tower. Or maybe not, because I've just noticed that fucking Pekango's here. Hey, Pekango. They say the castle was destroyed a hundred years ago. Somehow it looks even majestic in ruin. Are you sure? It's a beautiful picture, by the way, but are you sure? It's a little bit of an artistic artistic interpretation, maybe. Hey, we meet again. Are you out traveling as well? I've traveled all over the world, so I'm happy to tell you about new places if you want. If you have a picture to show me, let's see it already. I'd like to learn more about my pictures, good sir. I love your hair. It it looks like a brush. I would like the help with this, because I have no idea where this is. Wouldn't even know where to start. That forest, I get the feeling I've seen it before. I can't say for certain, but I believe that may depict the forest just south of here. No, wait, maybe it's the forest on the other side of the river, but northeast of the bottom of swamp. Mmm, haven't seen that before. I went for a stroll around there recently, and I feel like I may have seen a view like that. The bottom of the swamp? Where the fuck's that? I... Is it northeast from here? Or up here somewhere, potentially? I didn't see any bottomless swamps, so- Oh, the bottomless swamp! Okay, so... Do you say northeast? I'm gonna ask him again. It's the forest on the other side of the river, northeast of the bottomless swamp. So, on the other side of the river, northeast of the bottomless swamp, which would mean, if I can get the right map, kind of northeast on the other side. It's kind of here. So we'll mark this as a memory, as a memory, I feel. That's kind of the best thing I can have for a memory. But we're going back here because I don't want to get distracted. When was the last time I took you somewhere new? I guess we've been to a lot of new places Revolve over the course of this ready. game. And I guess we go to the, like, the Korok Forest. That's new, but not somewhere where story is happening. Wow, I cannot believe it. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, yes, you. I am Groove. Groove of the... Of the Zora. I nearly said Goron, because it's so close. It is apparent that you are a traveller, but may I ask what brought you here? I could ask the same strange fish man. Hmm, a very astute of you. Uh, an excellent query. Query? Query? Who said query? Query indeed. I, by the order of Prince Sidon of Zora's Domain, am searching for a Hylian. Or I was, but then I fell asleep. Uh, I woke to a loud noise and awful quaking, and now here I am. On top of a Jai fucking tower! I'd like to get down and be on my way, but it's sim I'm simply too high up. I need to figure something out. Prince Sidon is down at the bridge below, but for some reason I cannot seem to catch his attention. But you! Uh, you are a Hylian, yes? Well then, my luck is improving! <laughs> That's good for you. You're gonna show me this bridge exactly. Prince Sidon! I found one! I found a Hylian! Uh, it's, it's over there somewhere. That's all I need, really. Hmm, Prince Sidon doesn't seem to notice my struggle. Perhaps I should swallow my fear and jump to the river below. But then I could return to him. But then I could return to him. He must be... No. Yeah, that works. He must be worried sick. Hmm. Hmm. No. No, I can't do it. I'm too high up. I'll likely meet the gods of the ever after... Of the ever after before I ever seek... Before I ever see Prince Sidon again. Mr. Hylian, I must apologize. It'll be some time before I can get back to Prince Sidon. Please, you must leave me here and go on ahead. I'm gonna go with Sidon... 
Because that works in my brain. Uh, what is this bridge you were talking about? So just this general way. It's very misty down there. I feel like there's no guarantee that I can fall off here and, you know, find a bridge. But I guess we just keep going this direction until we find a bridge. If he's, if he's somehow in, in shouting distance. What bridge is he talking about? This bridge? What was it called? Doesn't seem very important. What is- what are these? These are like mini towers. What is this ball? I can see the man there. I've seen him before. Give me that goddamn cutscene. Say hey there, young one. Up top, above you. Technically the same length. Height. <laughs> Pardon the entrance, but you're a Hylian, aren't you? I was hoping perhaps you'd have a moment to talk. Oh, he's very well spoken. My voice is going to be lovely for him, I'm sure. Aha! Hylian, yes, I knew it. Yes, this works. Oh, pardon me. I'm a little too deep for this. I'm Sidon, the Zora Prince. Just... Face. Love it. And what is your name? Go on, please tell me. You're, you're shouting a lot. The, the, the words are quite large. I'm concerned. Have you problems? Like, uh, Link? <laughs> Fucking end me. Your name is Link! What a fantastic name! Uh, the, mm, the, though I cannot shake the feeling that I have heard it somewhere before. Well, in any case, it is a strong name. But, to be honest, I've been watching you. I've seen the way you work. I can tell by how you carry yourself that you are no ordinary person. Link! You must be a strong warrior among the Hylians, correct? Yeah, go on then. Aha! Just as I suspected! I am a Zora Prince, after all. I have an eye for talent that is unparalleled. Yes! Exquisite! Yes. I've been searching for someone like you for a long time. A man like you, Link, who carries himself with power. Right now. Uh, Zora's- Right now? Zora's domain is in grave danger because of the massive rainfall coming from v Divine Beast Varuta. Please, promise you will help us. We need your strength, warrior. Are you drowning? That's what that sounds like. Won't you please come to Zora's domain with me? The- The rain from- Is- Is a problem. Are you drown- You can't drown. Wow, really? Thank you, Link. You are indeed a man. You are, you are indeed the man I thought you were. Now Zora's domain will be safe for certain. No time to waste. Hurry up and head over. Because of the rain, the cliffs are too wet to climb. To reach the domain, you will need to go straight along this path. As a Hylian, I know you are unable to swim off the river. As such, the path to the domain can be a bit treacherous. You will likely have a tough fight in store. There are monsters up there that attack with electricity. That sounds like a piece of cake. Don't give up. I believe in you. I like this. This is good. I. You're one of the more positive... Like, important NPCs in this game. Like, you can go back to the Rito village. That guy didn't like me, okay? Oh, that's right. I have something that I would like to give to you. This is just a small trinket to show that I have faith in you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Lix is everywhere. Go for the whole game without finding any. And then they're everywhere. He's even like, this is a Pokemon thing. A new Pokemon game where they just give you the solution. Almost. It is a drink that will increase your resistance to electricity. I'm not sure why, but its effects do not seem to work for Zora. Perhaps because it was made specifically for Hylians. So no one makes potions for you? Is that what you're saying? Tell me about all your problems, Zora people. It should work wonders for you, though. I shall go on ahead and make sure there is not anything strange going on where you are headed. I'm counting on you. I like him. He's very positive. He's like the antithesis of all the other important NPC companions, not the, the champions. The champions are relatively consistent, but like everyone else doesn't really like me. He doesn't want to talk to me. You know, the, the, the Gerudos actually physically hate me because I'm a man. So that's that's nice. Reach Zora's domain. Good plan. I need to clear my throat. In Inogo Bridge wasn't on the- oh, it is on the thing. Okay, maybe I'm just an idiot. So I guess we just follow the path. I did notice that sleeping in the soft bed back at the inn gave me an extra heart, which is kind of useful. You're going to throw things at me? It's got a rupee underneath it. Thank you so much for revealing the rupee to me. You fine, you very kind Lizalfos. I like it. So you want me to go via the path? I'm not sure I like that. I could technically- what is that? What is that fresh hell? I don't know. I could technically just Rivali scale up there and kind of make a mockery of this challenge, but I'm going to- I'm going to do it relatively straight for now. Where's this shrine? Are we gonna look- we're gonna put to practice what we learned about the shrines? Or are we gonna be dumb about the shrines? I don't really know. Everything's throwing rocks at us. You wanna fight me, don't you? No, you don't. I just showed why you don't, because it's not gonna end well for you. At some point, when I feel confident that I can't take or won't be taking damage that often, I would like to eat some hearty food. So we have, effectively, extra health for a very small cost. That is a- that's a lizard! Where's it gone? It's disappeared. I- or has it gone down? It's disappeared. It's actually just disapparated in the air. That's that's not good. 
it's a, it's a whimsical wiz whim whimsical wizard. Yeah, it's a it's a lizard wizard. Do we know the those words rhyme now? Apparently they always rhyme. That's fine. Um, <clears throat> what are these and are they important? I need to, uh, f throat's fucking awful. I mean, I can do small clears of the throat during the actual commentary, but to actually get it to working order, I've got to do a big clear of the throat, and it's not very. It doesn't sound good. I can see it peak my recording, my my microphone rather, and. I don't want to inflict that on you. Are these just lamps? I think they are just lamps. Is this a Korok puzzle? I, I thought it might be. I thought it might be, game, because that's how the Korok puzzles work. There's like no consistency. Oh, why are these guys shooting me? Why are they so accurate? Maybe because I'm so close. Maybe I should do something about that. But then again, if I stop and fight them, I'll invite the, the wrath of all of them. A silent shroom. A shroom, or rather a mushroom, that helps with your stealth indeed. Yes, I like it. Good to see that there's no limit to the end of... These look important, so I'll leave these here for now. Uh, no limit to the end of... Uh, oh, what's going on now? Hey, Link! That's good. So I could have Revali, Revali scaled this, that'd be funny. Sorry for calling you out. Uh, sorry I'm calling out to you from the river. Since I pressured pressured you into coming, I, w I'm, I was not sure you would really come through. I'm pleased things are going well. Ever since this strange occurrence, uh, there'll be more, a lot more monsters around here. Be careful as you proceed. And hurry, all of my fellow Zoras are anxiously wait awaiting your arrival. Because they're drowning in the massive amount of rain. That is an interesting problem. Uh, apparently I have to fix it. Gonna get the- It just- Oh, they disappear. No other animal does that. I guess, like, something else disappeared, like a dragonfly. I'm not sure we can take a picture of a dragonfly, but things are disappearing for random reasons, and I'm terrified of it. I feel, you know, I, I, it takes a relatively keen eye to notice the lizard or the salamander. It's not a salamander. It's not big enough to be a salamander, but I don't know. I feel like, ah, oh, noticing it is half the challenge. I almost ran into that. Who threw that? I'll throw it back if I was strong enough. My throat's going. That's fine, I guess. I don't know. Got to go over there. Because if we did the uh, Revali scale, then we'd miss out on all the interactions of everybody's favorite NPC in this game, and that's fine. Well, that's not fine, but um, the fact that the interactions of what the fuck's down this way? I'm going this way because there's apparently a place we can go. All the interactions with uh, I keep thinking Rivali. I'm not sure why. Sidon, Sidon, or Sidon? We can burn these. Don't tell me we can't game. I know we can because I feel like I did it at some point, or maybe I did in my dreams. Burn those fucking thorns. Get the fuck out of here. Don't want it. Open the chest. Better be good, I burned things to get here. 50 rupees. <clears throat> Barely will cover the cost of the fire arrow, that's fine. Uh, kind of, not not lost, but off the off the trail now. So we've got to follow the trail. As much as I'd like to just go in whatever direction I feel is the right direction. That's maybe not the right way of doing it. Is it, was this maybe the right direction after all? I don't really know, picking up hearty radishes. I'm being killed by uh, Zalfos with, with swords. Why, why, why would you do this? Why would you do this? Not, not a good idea. You see how bad of an idea it is? You go down there. You you think about what you did. Is this the path? It's not really a path, is it? There's enemies everywhere. How 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 bad have things gotten? There are enemies everywhere. My god, I can't I this is where I'm thinking that maybe using the Rivali's Gale and just skipping to the top might have been a good idea. It might have been a why did I why did I do it for in, in order to keep the challenge alive, in order to keep the, what the game wanted alive, it, I maybe not a good idea. This, these shallow ponds, little little ponds here, make me think that there might be something of value in here. Every time the game slows down from now on, after after last episode where the game just fucking crashed for no reason, we got these frogs. Hot footed frog, baby, yeah. I like having a frog in my companion. I want one. Yeah, you got that. You, I'm coming to get you. He just went through the wall. Okay. He won this round. What about this one? But what about your friend? I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna fucking get yeah, him. Mine. Mine. Disappeared again. You see what this is? It's like voodoo magic. Hey, over there. Where are you? Are you inside my head? That'd be inconvenient for both of us, wouldn't it? Sidon sees all. He is the friend of the ducks, apparently. Sorry for calling from uh, from so far away. The domain is still a ways off, but you're making good progress. Uh, I shall I shall be along soon myself. I, it won't. I won't be much longer. That's fine. In the meantime, I'll be cheering you on from here in the river. So hang on. Or hang in there. You can do it. Stay strong. He's so positive. He's such a breath of fresh air in this world that fucking hates us. So I appreciate everything that he's got to give. So 
just cross? Or keep going on the path? Maybe keep going on the path, because the path... We're not very far on the path. Uh, we gotta go to a bridge. We gotta go to that bridge? Go to that bridge. Nope, the other bridge. Go this way. Gotta find a bridge and cross it. We could use Revali's Gale and just skip this bit and just go straight there, but the game clearly wants me to do one thing, and I'm going to agree with the game out of principle rather, rather than out of out of uh, sense that it's maybe the right thing to do. Just get the fuck out of it. I missed all of them, or most of them. I don't like you people. Oh, God, all of them. Kaboom. Kaboom, baby. Normal arrows. Normal arrows for a special occasion. Yeah, look at all these. Look at all these spoils. I love it. I love it so. Eventually... When we get into elixirs, and I guess elixirs work like food. Well, I haven't we worked that out. The elixirs do work like food, but in terms of how you make them, the, you just have to only have certain things that work with elixirs and that sort of thing. I don't really know. Master Sword is kaput. Let's have something which isn't the Master Sword then. That's the, that, this is the right button now. Uh, get rid of our normal sword. You, you don't get me when I'm in my menu. Get out of my menu. You're ruining my problem. Through what's well, fine. Arrows. Arrows are very useful. I didn't think about it until... Not, not the fact that it's important, but it's important to kill the Lizalphos so you get the arrows, is what I'm trying to get at. And some seared steak. So that's... Oh. oh, that's good. I remember when that was like the best thing we had. It's a boar with red tusks which seems uh, like it's blood or something. So I'm just gonna... Are you, are you, are you aggressive? I have to check. Are you aggressive? N not really. <laughs> not really entirely. Is this an important bridge? I'm gonna fight all of you. I'm gonna fight all of you because you've 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 messed with the wrong hero, man. It's very angry. Everything looks like a weapon. Roasted bass, yes. Want some of that? And the arrows. Wow, the arrows are everywhere. Is there? And I guess there might be a maximum number of arrows that we can hold at one time. What's the problem with all the rain again? I can't remember. But uh, it doesn't seem like much of a problem, unless of course you're trying to climb up, in which case, fuck you. That's why. Um, it's not gonna be five arrows. I, I got that. It's such a grand chest. I got that from just like, oh no. I got five arrows in some case. No, I got five arrows in some cases. Ten arrows just from fighting Ailes Alphos. I so want to go up there, but we'll miss out on all the interactions with Sidon or Sidon. I'm gonna go with Sidon. Okay. You didn't know I was here. How did you not know I was here? You give me all your bass. I want to cook it now, but I, I'm busy. I'll do it later, okay? Oh, it's a frog. Gonna get the frog. It looks like a different frog. It goes through the... Frogs through the ground, guys. How... I can't compete with that. How, how do you expect me to compete with that? I could enable no clip, but I don't... I don't know how to do that yet. I haven't got, like, console commands on this Nintendo Switch game. Maybe I could, you know... In the future, when people have hacked this game to some incredible degree, then yeah. Oh, no! Oh no, you've blocked my way. How will I get through? I'll just like climb slightly around it. There you Oh no. That was difficult. I'm gonna hit you with my sword. My my just just sword. It's just called a just called a sword, you know. Nothing more than that, nothing more special than that. You're not even facing me. You should face where your opponents are coming from, because I'm guessing that you launched the rock in my face. So maybe maybe your priorities are a little bit out of whack. Zora Spear and Lizal Spear. We've got both of these already. Okay. Good to know. Uh, expecting more enemies, because these look like, like, protection. Protection from the enemies? Or something? What is this? Why does it look so important? Tell me all about it, game. History of the Zora, part one. Oh, dickleberries. The eternal Zora, uh, that's told by King Durafan. The rains have blessed Laneru since ancient times with an abundance of pure, clean water. Seeking a bounty of such water, the Zora gathered here. Thus, as the legends go, the domain was born 10,000 years ago. The land was also rich in ore, and so a unique form of sta uh, stone masonry, got it, was developed to create our new home. The domain is a one giant sculpture, a feat of architecture that has drawn admirers the world over. Our great domain will ever stand as a hallmark of the esteemed artists who made it, an eternal, eternal symbol of Zora pride. That was an interesting uh, little little brief history or something. Are, are these are these minerals on the right? They th I, looks like. Oh no! Looks like they are. Maybe I should have heeded the uh, the advice and maybe used this Alexa thing, which actually hit. Does it heal us? That one heals us. Maybe we should use that. We'll do both, okay? Because we're gonna we're trying we're trying things out now. Yeah. Did that say recipe? Recipe? What? Oh, we found where the recipes are. Why have I only just found this? Why am I so? Lacking in intelligence. 
Don't answer that, because I feel like you, everyone would answer that anyway. Okay, that's fine. Do we, do we, do we still dropping things? I need to cough again. All right, we got our, sh we got our shield. Everything else is causing problems. The, the, the radius on this is fucking absurd. Try and hit them. Try and hit them from a distance. We have three arrows. Might be important. Might have, been, might have been a wise idea to use other arrows, but this works as well. Look at the radius! Look at the radius! It's fucking insane! Oh god, there's nothing. What's a boy to do? What's a boy to do against this force of great magnitude? No, don't don't whistle for a pony. It's not important right now. Jackers couldn't hear the call. No surprise. It's no big surprise! Oh god. How are you supposed to? How are you supposed to deal with that? The radius is... Nintendo. A little big, to be honest. Nintendo, stop it. Forest Dwellers bow is going down. Where's it gone? Did you come and engage me? Is that what this was? I'm not sure. I'd like my weapons back, so I'm gonna go back for them, but... The radius is insane! <laughs> a little bit excessive. All the arrows in the world, and occasionally some weapons. Here's my sword. It's mine now. That's good. This is what I was looking at. These don't look like minerals, but they are a completely different color to the background, so... Nothing? Are these just stepping stones or something? I don't really know. Is it a goddamn Korok puzzle, which, you know, somehow works? That's a reinforcement cell. It's not important. Okay. I have the shock resistance. Maybe the shock resistance would have been a good idea to use a little bit earlier. I love the cover. Cover would have been useful if I had some of the cover, but, you know, it fucking doesn't work. Every single solitary stone or rock is important to me, okay? It might be a Korok puzzle. It might not be, but... For the off chance that it is, I will look like an idiot if I did nothing with it. Are the uh, I like your like bouncer herons. Herons! See, they look like black winged herons or purple winged herons, like a dark black or a dark black? A dark grey is what I meant to say. So I thought they might have been something else, but was it Luto's Crossing? Who was the name? R Ruto Lake, that's fine. Luto, what was the name of the... was it Laruto? In Wind Waker, the Sage? Yeah, not Luto. That's something else. The temptation to just skip that. Oh, I want to. I want to. But then Sidon might be might be waiting for us like hey. here. Hey Link! From miles away. Look below! Down here! I'm gonna speak like this. You can't hear me anymore. Oh no! Where have I gone? I'm down here, splashing around. Hello. What a man. What a fine person. You are still pretty far off, my friend, but I I'm, I was sure you'd be passing over this bridge, so I've been watching uh, I've been waiting for you. You'll be in Zora's domain before you know it. In fact, I'm going to head that way too. I shall meet you there. Whoa, Link! Beware, warrior! A monster approaches from behind you! Really? Oh no. Are you gonna help me fight? Oh no, you're just gonna drop me in it. That seems... Fair, I guess. It's fine. I mean, he warned me. I don't know how he warned me from down there, but... I don't know how he saw him in the slightest, but... I don't know, maybe it's useful. Wind cleaver, baby! Wind cleaver, baby! Oh yeah, baby! It's so good! It's really impressive bit of weaponry. Even though there are probably better two-handed weapons in the game. Pretty sure there are better two-handed weapons in the game, such as the Ancient Battle Axe Double Plus, or whatever it is. But the, uh, the wind cleaver looks like a one-handed weapon, but it's awesome and large, and I like it. Sidon will be waiting for us, so we can't skip it, okay? Hylian Mushroom, that's fine. Eventually, we're going to run out of mushrooms, and then our compendium will be full of mushrooms! And I will feel a certain amount of satisfaction that our compendium is now full of mushrooms, but, uh, until that day, we got to take a picture of everything. We have not got a picture of a hearty radish, and I picked up many hearty radishes, so that's my fault. Hearty radish, incidentally, if we ever get to a fire, we can technically use on a fire, or whatever, that, that kind of made sense. Use it on a fire to get more yellow hearts, which is lovely. At the moment, we've got lots of yellow hearts, or enough yellow hearts to have 15 hearts, is that right? Yeah. Which is good. And I think, based on the fact that we had one more on the second row, we can have a total of 30 hearts in this game, which is significantly more than, or 50% more than previous Zelda games. Maybe because this game is actually a little more punishing than previous Zelda games. That's not really, uh, too- Whoa! Don't do it. Don't do it. Think of the- think of the kid- think of the children. You made that- you made that, like, metal block go miles. How did you do it? I don't know. Tell me your secrets. I don't know what happened. Things definitely happened. I was there for things when they happened. You were there for things when they happened too, weren't you? Okay. <laughs> it's fine. I'm slightly confused. I'm terrified of anything that conducts electricity. Or not even conducts electricity, but causes electricity to happen. Because, uh, we kind of have a 
we ha kind of have a defense for that, not really. What's on this one? Yeah. History of the Zora. A denim, a denim too. One, even. Why does it say two? I'm, I'm losing it, guys. Uh, King Dorofan stands his ground. Around a hundred years ago, after King Dorofan ascended to the throne, a stray guardian crossed, crossed upper, upland Zorana into our, <laughs> into our domain. That's fine. The guardian seemed unstoppable. Our best soldiers of spears barely left a scratch on his metal hull. It was then that our great, then our, then our king, Dorofan, without a thought for his own safety, came out to face the guardian himself. With supernatural strength, he lifted the guardian and hurled it into a ravine. The impact of the fall left the guardian in, in pieces, and it was never to travel another Zora ever again. The citizens celebrated the king's valor, and from then on, the, oh, their trust and respect for him grew beyond compare. You can still see the scar he earned that day on his forehead, a token of his triumph. So, if that's a hundred years ago, I presume that's the champion, but the king... The king sounds large, but the the guy we saw... I don't actually know what the, the Zora champion... what his name is? I don't think it's Dorofan. Dorofan is like king. He didn't look like a king. Kings are, are rarely sent into battle like that. They're really, you know, it doesn't happen that often. Maybe in some kind of whimsical way that I've got to protect my, my kingdom's honor. If this was Fire Emblem, then sure, but... Not necessarily. You never see a king go off to battle. You've got too many disposable people for that. What the holy hell is that? And why am I just drawn towards it? I, you know, everything else is just not interesting to me anymore. What is that? Is that... I think I know what that is. We'll come back to that in a little bit. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to get too close because I think I know what that is. That's fine. We'll come back. We just like glide our way through this incredibly treacherous environment. We don't really have to, uh, work our way around, although there might be- there might be silence somewhere! We might be missing dialogue cues, or, or, like, bits of history as well. There's that as well. You want me to stop for the history, right? Moblin! We haven't got a picture of a regular Moblin until right now, but he's in our compendium right now, so that's good. What is our compendium looking like nowadays? Because we haven't seen it in a while. It's getting full. It's getting- there's, like, whole pages missing, but look at this! This is looking- complicated. I like him. I know you can go to Pura's assistant, who I can't remember the name of, and he will fill in certain bits for 100 rupees a pop, which is good later in the game when you've got more money than ability to take pictures of things you can't take a picture of anymore, such as boss fights. So, I don't know. No idea what these are going to be, because a treasure? Treasure chest. That makes sense. No idea what else would be there, but I guess at some point we're going to find that out. That's fine. More history. History of the Zora, part 7. The hero who defeated the Linol, Lionel, as told by King Dorofan. Gonna read it. There was a time when the people of the land were threatened by the... Or... Oh, something beast. Dread beast. Lionel. Lionel, who lived on... Mountain. But one Hylian drove the beast back and restored peace to the domain. The Zora Helm was in this fight. <laughs> One in this fight is now north of here, now in the ruins near Lake some, something Lake something Lake. The there to honor the dead of the deeds of the hero Link. Yeah, time has taken its toll on this. I know I tried. So that's the, that's the puzzle. Not 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 going to give me a quest for that. So we've got to find like three letter. Mm, three lesser lake north of here, would it say? Something lake. I don't know what the lake would be. Ruto Lake, maybe? We'll find it eventually when we're not we're not preoccupied by getting to a place before we drown in this inc this looks really good. Drown in the incredible amount of rain which is coming down. How do the Zoras cope in such treacherous conditions? I'm sure it's really bad for them. Their crops must be Drowned or you know waterlogged or whatever what's whatever the technical name is for what happens to crops in rain That's rocks gone over there. It's not important. All the rocks are important. That's where the that's where the uh, the fallacy is Okay Anyway, welcome to Zora's domain eventually. It looks really good. Maybe a little bit better at day and when it's not raining, but even so I'm not gonna complain shock resistance has now worn off at basically the perfect time Maybe. Maybe a little further back when we'll... Maybe a bit earlier, so we didn't get absolutely fucked up by shock arrows, because they're terrifying. Anyway, Zora's Domain. It looks really good. It looks really good. I like it. Could look a little bit better. I imagine the floors are a little slippy with all the with all the rain and stuff. I like your home. I like what you've done, the, done with the place. 
Was this built out of one stone? Because I don't think it was. Whoa! Yeah, I'm whoa indeed. I made it! I've been waiting for you, Link! He's so positive. He's so impressive. Welcome! Behold the pride of my people, Zora's Domain. Now I shall introduce- Now I shall introduce you to the king! Hurry this way! Yeah! It looks really good. It's- I- In a way, I don't like how it's out in the open. Because I always imagined Zora's Domain to be hidden away. But I guess it is kind of hidden away. While you can still see the sky, so... I'm not conflicted, but... It's an interesting design choice, in a way. Are we gonna go above? But I wanna go to the shrine! Okay. I wanna go to the shrine, though. I may go to the shrine after that. That's fine. That's okay. I'd also like to kind of get a, a read on our situation. Incidentally, what I said back there... You okay? That's good. What I said back there about, oh, I know what that is, I'm not gonna go there. Pretty sure that's the Divine Beast in one of these lakes. Maybe this one? Could've been that one? I don't know. Because it had... Uh, the, it had the right coloration. You are the king. You are giant. Are you Dorofan? How old are you? Many questions. Maybe you'll answer some of them. You're very old. Am I being disrespectful yet? I'm not sure. Somebody say something in a cutscene way. Nobody said anything. Ah, oh, you must be the Hylian that Sidon brought here. Correct? Are you old? You are in my, my mind. You did well to come all the way here. No, you're not old in the slightest. I am King Dorothan, ruler of the Zora. Yes. Hmm, that object upon your waist. Is that not a Sheikah Slate? Yes. Hmm. Now that, now that I've gotten a good look at you, uh, it is all too clear who you are. Somebody recognizes me. Whoa, you are the Hylian Champion Link. Do not tell me you have forgotten me. Just a little bit. The Hylian Champion? Oh, that's not, I'd say, the Hylian Champion? You can't mean the, the, the Link, that champion. So that's where I've- that's where I've heard of your name before. What a faithful coincidence that we should cross paths. <laughs> Indeed, I cannot believe it. The Hylian Champion, Link, has appeared before us. We have met numerous times, I'll have you know. But I can't remember any of them. Ah, so many memories. My mind is overflowing with nostalgia, my friend. I've heard a terrible rumor that you had fallen in combat. Fallen in combat? But it appears you managed to survive. Extraordinary. Uh, technically I've been sleeping. In a kind of enforced way. I didn't do it. Come again? Sleeping, you say? Hmm, is, is that why you do not seem to remember me? But surely you must remember my precious daughter, daughter Mifa. Yes, you do, do you not? Not a clue. I mean, I do. I know, but not a clue. I cannot believe it. Have you tr have you truly forgotten my dear Mifa as well? Is Mifa right? Sounds weird. You and Mifa were so close, yet you do not remember her? Young hero, please look upon you. Please look upon the beauty of Zora's domain. Do you see that statue, just gazing upon Mipha's immortalized form, still not jog your memory? I mean... Yeah, sure. Well, perhaps your memory will return in time. I dearly hope so. Father, I do not believe discussing my sister is helping matters at the moment. Link seems confused. Ah, uh, it's the family tiff. Oh, yes, of course. But first, it is worth noting how remarkable it is that Sidon brought a champion here without realizing it. That is quite a feat, my boy. Oh, <laughs> that is a good one. Yes, Link. I doubt, I doubt not that you have endured a great many trials. Still, I must ask you to hear my plea. Now then, hero, I must inform you that Zora's domain is in uh, danger of vanishing because of Divine Beast Varuta. So you're going to lose the structure, but you're fine. Maybe think about changing with the times. You can't, can't be not flexible. Or rigid. Rigid is a better word. I shall do you the courtesy of speaking bluntly. We alone cannot stop this beast. Will you lend us your strength? I mean, sure. What?! Are you the old lady? Yes. Oh, no. Yeah. King Darf and my liege, please do not speak so. To ask a Hylian for help. Why, the very thought of it curls my fins. I mean, they could stand to be a little bit more curled so they aren't just dangling straight down. Muzu, I expected more of you. How can you still protest? Uh, Muzu, it is rude to speak that way to your king and his guest. Link is here because I invited him. With such unprecedented rainfall, we have no choice but to rely on the aid of an uh, the aid of a trustworthy Hylian. I misread that as untrustworthy. I was a little confused. That's fine. Have we not have we not, uh, have we not already discussed this and arrived at that very conclusion? He is the key to saving Zora's domain. I have no doubt in my mind. Mm. Indeed, Link is a champion through and through. As things now stand, Zora's domain, nay, perhaps all of Hyrule, is doomed to be swallowed by the sea. This is bigger than all of us, my friend. Zora and Hylians alike must put their differences aside and band together. Have you forgotten already, my king? We cannot trust these lowly Hylians. A hundred years ago, they abused the power of an ancient, uh, an ancient civilization and turned Hyrule into what it is today. And that is not the least of it. I mean, we don't see them that bad. Fabled, like, arguments in Zelda history. Hylians 
Gerudos, that makes sense. It is their fault that Lady Lady Mifa has lo was lost to us. Oh, she dead. That's not good. Mm. Link. Divine Beast Varuta has great power. It has the unique ability to create an endless supply of water. I need to cough! Not even brought about by doing that voice. It's just... Oh, no. My throat's a little, little dodgy of, uh, recently. Of late, it's been mercilessly... Uh, spouting water into the air. As a result, this area has been plagued by heavy rain. Heavy rains. For us, Zora, water and air are as one. So, so you would not think that this would be quite so critical of a problem. Sadly, the rains have filled the eastern reservoir nearly to the point of flooding. If the reservoir bursts, as it soon will, I fear immense damage will, will befall not only Zora's domain, but also the area downstream from us. There, Hy Hylian lives are in very grave danger. Interesting uh, dilemma you have there. I heard, yeah, I heard it. I thought, I thought for a second that sounded like a, uh, an alarm. It's calling out, yes. Divine Beast is an elephant. We know this already, because it was in the bottom right, and I've already mentioned that. This is what I saw. This is what I nearly went towards and thought that it might be cool. Maybe not the best idea in the circumstances. Oh, excuse me. It's okay. I appreciate a... Effectively, a robotic elephant. That, to me, sounds like a wonderful idea that more games should explore. Technically. That's for Trunk, in case you're confused. That's not... That's okay. We're all a little confused. A water elephant is a thing. Not necessarily one that lives underwater. That... They're, they're, called, they're called blue whales, okay? They're, they're almost the same thing. It's okay. Mm. The Divine Beast, Varuta. Your Princess Zelda often studied the Divine Beast. That is, in the time before the Great Calamity. According to her research, the orbs located on Ruta's shoulders are mechanisms that can control the water it generates. However, they require ele electricity to work. So we're not turning upside down or inside out. We're just, uh... We're controlling water. I'm not saying... So Hopefully it's a bit better than that. These orbs are clearly out of control now because there is no electricity coursing through them to through to stop them. Maybe we need electricity to stop them. There's the idea. Segin, Segin, Segin. Yep. Okay. Segin, who is quite who's quite shock resistant for Azora, hit one with a shock arrow. Sure enough, it slowed the water a bit. Unfortunately, as a as an aquatic race, we Zora are terribly vulnerable to the power of electricity. Uh, perhaps. Perhaps because we could not safely strike it with enough electricity at once, the water soon returned to its full force. There's a lot of, lot of talking in this episode. That is why I went in search of a Hylian who could help us. You love that pose. The game loves you doing that pose. Link, I'm certain you've already figured this out, but we need you to use shock arrows to get those orbs working properly again. Hmm. We will aid you in any way I can, of course. I will aid you in any way I can, of course. Please, hero, I beg of you, help me stop Ruta's rampage of destruction. So Mifa was actually the, yeah, Mifa was the champion. I forgot about that. What? What'd I say? Princess Zelda herself instructed you to board the Divine Beast and appease it from within? So then, Princess Zelda is still alive? Yeah, sure. Kind of. Apparently she's 117, but looking good for 117, I think. I do not believe it. She was alive this whole time, just as you were. The events of 100 years ago cannot be altered if it is true. But if we can regain control of the Divine Beast, then they may yet prove useful in sealing, sealing Calamity Ganon once and for all. Oh, probably. Uh, I did not- I, uh, I did not know you had such grand ambitions, Link. I've got many ambitions. Stop doing the pose. It's kind of- I wouldn't say it's worn off, but, you know, has its moment. Wondrous, naturally, I shall help too. Uh, once it has stopped rampaging, you can easily climb inside it. Come, Link, let us- let us appease Ruta together. Yeah, sure, sounds like fun. I get more- I get to meet more of your people. Thank you, Link, truly. We are in your debt. Our goal is the, our goal is the same. That means our, our meeting was nothing short of destiny. Now then, allow me to get, offer you this gift as a show of faith. Oh, Zora armor. Oh, yeah. This is what I was after quite a long time ago. More swim speed, because at the moment, it's pretty bad. So, uh, so long as you wear this, you can ascend waterfalls just like a Zora. Whoa. That's not what that said. It said faster swim speed. Not, uh, I can ascend fucking waterfalls. What is this? Some kind of crazy Pokemon game. King Dorothan! Surely you do not int really intend to give this outside of the Zora armor. <laughs> Countless generations of Zora princesses have gifted that armor to the one they have sworn to marry. Were we going to marry Mifa? Is that a thing? Princess Mifa made that one there with her own hands. It is far too important to entrust to a shady Hylian. I don't know that shady. I, I look pretty radiant, actually. He may be a champion, but Mifa had no such relationship with him. So why should he receive such an honor? Mm. This is just too much, my liege. I do not understand it one bit. You're pretty disrespectful for like a a, a right hand person, still working on the on the uh, on the on the gender. Hmm. That Musa was not easily swayed once his mind is set. Apparently, it's a guy. I couldn't tell. That's fine. You can you can live your life like that. I don't give a shit. You must understand. He was in charge of educating my dear daughter Mifa. 
Uh, naturally, she means a lot to him, just as she means the world to us. Ever since we lost her to the Calamity, she has grown to despise Hylia, and she was a champion. I'm remembering the cutscene so many episodes ago. I hope you- I hope you can forgive his rudeness. That explains a lot, because I was wondering how else would we find him? What- find her, rather. Hm? But what shall we do now? I tasked Muzu with help with finding the shock arrows. We will need to appease Varuta. But now he's rushed off in a huff. Uh, Link, do not let- I have shock arrows! Link, do not let his words concern you. I- I will work this out with Muzu. I shall return shortly. I have shock arrows. I have many shock arrows. I can buy more. I bought so many not so long ago. Might as well use them. Sidon, I suppose that means you are going to tell him. Tell him what? Mm. Tell me something, or tell the Muzu guy. Link, Muzu is most likely at the square down below. Would you mind going down there? I would like you to try to speak with him. I mean, I guess I could. That was an interesting bit of lag. Honestly, it did show up on the recording, so it wasn't just... It wasn't just the recording. It was, it was my game. It showed up and that's fine. So, I'm thinking... We haven't got a lot of time. What I'm going to do, on the basis that we haven't got a lot of time, is activate the shrine, end the episode off, and then do the shrine in the next episode, because that, in my mind, it works best. I heard noises that sound like Dorito people don't reuse sound effects video game. This is where we, this is where we buy things, apparently. That's kind of, I, okay, didn't even look like a shop. That's, that's fine. Maybe because everything's so open plan. I can't even go out this goddamn window. That's terrible. I hate it. That's an invisible wall. I hate it so much. I hate invisible walls more than anything in anything. Probably more things you can hate a little more violently than that, but even so. That's a crab. It's a bright-eyed crab. That's okay. Uh, let's just- let's just press this. That's fine. Anyway, this has been Luigi. This has been Let's Play Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. In the next episode, we're going to do this shrine. We're going to, uh, help Muza, uh, Muzu know that I'm a good Hylian. I'm a very trustworthy Hylian, rather than- Zorus didn't always have conflicts, did they? Because they can't have done, because- like, Hyrule Royal Family? Zoras are the, you know, Royal Family's best friends or something, so I'm not sure what happened there. We'll work that out. And I guess at some point, we're gonna go and fight a, an elephant. A water elephant. Gonna be a lot of fun. Thanks for watching! See you in the next one. Take care.